Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Tammy, and this is Life of Low Blue. <laughs> Why can't I ever say that normally? Like, ever. Uh, what's up, guys? I'm so excited to be recording a video today. I know I'm just very inconsistent on this YouTube thing, like, this year. Mm, I don't even know, but a lot of things happened this year, and I was really busy, and I've just been trying to get videos in where I can. So, super excited to be filming this Get Ready with Me today. I'm going to a Christmas party tonight and I'm really excited it's my friend's um, annual Christmas party it's always a lot of fun so I'm just gonna get ready get to do a little holiday look and I'm just really excited to chat with y'all give you like a mini life update because I don't know I just 2019 is about to be over and like there's so much that has happened 2019 has been amazing it's been great for me and my family I've been blessed I graduated in 2019 like there's so much to look back and reflect on and just so much to look forward to in 2020 so I'm super excited um but yeah I'm just gonna give you all a little little look I'll give you all my outfit and my makeup my hair is already done so I'm just laying my edges right now y'all know the scarf real OGs know that this is the scarf I always wear <laughs> every time I'm laying my edges and real OGs know that this is the backdrop that I've also used once before I don't really usually use backdrops I just use natural settings but super excited to be here with y'all super excited to record this video super excited to chat and like let y'all know what it is um i love christmas i love holiday time and my family's going on a vacation in a couple weeks two weeks oh my god two weeks yes yeah, two weeks i'm about to be getting ready to fly out to florida we are going on a vacation so y'all are definitely gonna get vlogs you know travel vlogs are like my favorite thing to record ever so we're gonna be vlogging that but i just wanted to give y'all a little couple of holiday videos while i'm not in the tropics while i'm actually in chicago and um it's gonna be a lot of fun so expect some christmas vlogs of the little christmas events i go to and then yeah expect my vacation vlogs with my family so excited so 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 excited but um yeah guys let me go do my eyebrows because i really can't do them on camera i just i'm not that talented um but it shouldn't take that long since they're kind of like done and then i'm gonna be back and we can get it popping and get it cracking okay guys Hey guys, so I just finished my eyebrows. Hope y'all like them. They're looking good. They're looking fleeky. I think so. I think they look good. Um, and then I just put cornbread in the oven because that's what I'm taking to my friend's Christmas party. Um, you know, it's a potluck, so we all gotta bring something. But it's funny because I was actually planning on bringing jollof rice, but I just didn't want to bring it because I'm on a diet and I'm really trying to not eat rice. So I just didn't want to bring <laughs> That's kind of selfish. I don't want to make something that I can't even, like, partake it like is that ghetto probably but honestly cornbread isn't really much better i'm not really trying to eat bread either but i love cornbread so i was like i just have thanksgiving cornbread and now i kind of want some more so let me make cornbread <laughs> i'm sure they would have loved jollof but it's okay um next time next time but you guys so i did my eyebrows what do i even do next i don't even know i already did a primer um i guess i'll do an eye look i don't really know if i want to do like a real eye look I haven't done real eye looks in a long time. I've just been doing my dark crease, put a color in the thing, and go by my business. But let's see. But what are you guys doing for Christmas? Honestly, I'm really, really excited about this family vacation. So if y'all know, I usually go to Nigeria. If y'all don't know, I usually go to Nigeria in December. Because my parents live in Nigeria. But this year, we're going on a 10-year anniversary cruise to the cruise um, for the cruise we went on 10 years ago to the Bahamas. And um, with all my cousins, all my family, like, my family is lit. So, honestly, the fact that we're all going to be together and we're, like, everybody's in different places in their lives and in the, in the world, people are in different states. So, we don't ever get to link up like we used to. And I grew up so close to my cousins. Like, we were all, oh, my mallet just fell. <laughs> so, this is, like, something that we planned for, like, the past... I want to say the past two years that we we're gonna go on this again and i'm so glad it became a reality because y'all i was struggling to pay this cruise fee this cruise cost cost me about 700 something dollars for the cruise alone and then i had to pay for the ticket to florida so that was like another four something so <laughs> if there's one thing i'm going to do is turn up like nobody is going to stop my turn up because i spent over a thousand dollars on this like if, if, you, if you told me two years ago I'll be funding my own cruise now I'd be like you're actually joking like no way no how but I'm really proud of myself because honestly this is my first like this is probably the biggest thing I've ever like saved for and 
not really saved for it because if I saved for it, it wouldn't have been such an attack on my bank account. But um, this, this is something that I really, really wanted to do and like our parents were not about to fund it for us. So we all paid for ourselves. So I feel, you feel like a, you feel a sense of joy. Like I really did this. Like I paid for this vacation so nobody's going to tell me ish. I'm going to enjoy it. I'm going to have fun regardless. So that's kind of what we are right now. I'm really, really, really excited because... We're gonna be in the tropics. I don't want to tell y'all where yet, but I might have already said it in one video. I don't know. We're gonna be somewhere, somewhere tropical. You know, we're leaving from Florida like most cruises do. So I'm really excited, guys. I don't know how this eye look is going so far, but um, okay, which color should I put on my lid? I'm asking y'all like you can really answer me right now. Sometimes I wish you could. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna finish my eyes and then come back because I don't want this to be too long. It's not my whole face to do. Um, ignore my gel. It always looks white when I first like unlay and then it gets normal later. I'm using Lancome. People, a lot of people ask about my foundation, so I will show this. It's not focusing, but Lancome Tint Tint Idol Ultra Wear is what I use on my face. I usually just do this, this. Oh. In my areas, you know, on my head, my forehead big, okay. And then today I'm gonna use a brush, but sometimes I use a beauty blender. But, um, y'all, do you ever think about like the fact that the way you do your makeup now, like the way you look now, like right now you think you pop it, but then in a few years you're gonna be like, what the heck was I doing? Dang, I put a lot on. Whoa. And that kind of scares me because I'm like, when I started college, I didn't even know how to do makeup. So I learned everything when I, did, when I was in college. Because I went to boarding school and I had freaking Nigeria where you definitely can't wear makeup. Can't even wear powder without them crying. <laughs> but um, it's just interesting because when I look at how I did my makeup freshman year, I was busted. And it's like, now I'm like, oh, I'm cute. I'm cute or whatever. But then it's like, in a few years... I'm gonna be like, ew, what was I doing? This looks really orange by the way, but don't worry, it doesn't. It doesn't stay that way, okay? Oxidizes and then it just looks normal. It also looks way more orange on camera. What the heck? Huh? I'm trying to have me out here looking like an oompa loompa. Are they even orange? I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> like Auntie Jackie says, I always let my concealer sit for a minute. And this concealer is the best. Instant age rewind by Maybelline is it's amazing it does wonders my under eyes look bright and great and I love my under eyes to look really bright I don't use two concealers like a lot of people do I used to use LA concealer which I still use on my brows but this is just such a better consistency and it's thick and I don't have to cake as much on and then when you just leave it in a little bit and let it like it's beautiful oh my gosh it's it's legit it's good Conceal. Yeah, see my shadow is not perfect at all. But we're not gonna look at that. We're not gonna look at that. We're not gonna look at that. I need to get my lash. Hold up. Three lashes keep getting me right. Keep me popping all the time. I love her packaging. I love everything about Lee lashes. Um, if you wanna purchase, hit my sister up or hit up. I'll put it in the description below the Instagram page for Ellie Lashes, but yeah. Shout out to y'all. You guys see this concealer? Do you see? Wonders never end. Oh my gosh. It just, it just looks so good all the time. Like people always ask me what concealer I use when I use it because it's just flawless. Like you don't even have to bake for it to be. I know my face has no dimension now. I'm still contour, but y'all get into this. Get into this concealer. I'm telling y'all, you need to buy it. Not sponsored, so never mind. You can do whatever you want, but it's the truth. Okay. So I'm doing a bit of cream contour so I can be snatched. Okay. But I just realized how many firsts I've, I'm about to do in this one weekend. Um, this weekend, I already went to my first Bulls game yesterday. Shout out to my brother for getting us tickets to that. And 
tomorrow I'm going ice skating, guys. No, I'm scared, okay? I don't like to fall down. I don't think anybody likes to fall down, but I particularly do not like to fall down, especially not in front of random people in the park. So, um, it should be interesting. It should. But you know, I'll do anything once. That's what that's my motto, honey. I'll do anything once, but if it's terrible, you will not catch me going ice skating again. But it's for my friend's birthday and I love him, so you know, I love my friends. Be doing it. I'm gonna bake a little bit. I don't really bake, I just put powder there. I put powder there. And then I like kind of brush it off. Yo, are you guys going to Afro Nation? Because so many people have been asking me if I'm going, y'all. And my fr I was supposed to go for my friend's birthday. That was the original plan, but financially, I just don't know if I can handle it right now because I have trips already planned for 2020 that are like more important or like family related. I would love to go to Afro Nation. Comment down below if you are going or if you've been before. I know that they've also announced oh there's the one in Ghana that's also in December so if you're going to that that's cool too or if you're going to the Puerto Rico one next year in March all the Americans but like yeah it's crazy because the flights are actually really expensive um, and uh, the Airbnbs are all going so I don't know let's talk about Cardi the fact that Cardi B had naked naked and naked strippers on her Instagram story I was confusion when my cousin told us in the group chat like y'all need to go watch Cardi's story I was like why and then I see I, mean, I knew she was in Nigeria so I was like oh my gosh what else has she done because I've been watching her story since she's been in Nigeria because I just want to know like what is she going what is she going to be doing in Nigeria like obviously she has a show tonight I think but I was just like how is she going to like it and stuff so I've been watching her stories even though I don't even follow her um but dang I did too much for the blush Woo! what too much blush i always do that i love blush that's me getting carried away but um yeah she's interesting to see all the celebrities in nigeria i really wish i was going to nigeria not really wish i was but i'm gonna miss it um nigeria is always a vibe it's always fun even though i don't really usually go to the concerts because nigerian concerts mm, child i've been burned a couple times a few times but um I know it's just going to be lit and it's going to be fun. So everybody that's going, be safe. Drink your water. Have a safe, dirty December. Dirty December, as they call it. <laughs> Don't. Use protection. Do whatever you, like, do do you, but be safe. Because um, it's still a crazy world we live in. And women are still getting attacked and raped and abused every day on the regular. So please, if you are going to be out in Nigeria doing fun things in December, just make sure you're safe. Make sure you are with people, surround yourself, people that love you that are gonna make sure that they keep you safe because I don't want any of y'all getting hurt or going missing or anything, okay? Who's calling me? I'm back with my red lip on, okay, y'all. This red is really shouting, <laughs> But yo, red lips make your teeth look so white. My teeth are not that white. Anyway, guys, I'm done. I put my lashes on. Y'all see that? my red lip on I used a brown lip liner just because I was scared because you never know how red lips are gonna go but I really like this uh, shout out to Deb again thank you girl putting me onto this it's called stiletto kitten heels it's a NYX lip liquid suede and it is in the shade kitten heels and it's a cute little NYX lipstick if you need a good red on a budget it's like seven dollars or something from Target or a drugstore so yeah guys let's get into this outfit now we wasting time let's get into this bit back with my outfit let me do a little spin for you um on my feet i have these zara boots that i thrifted um you might recognize them from one of my instagram posts they were there i have these pants from forever 21 that i actually got during black friday and this bodysuit that i also wore on instagram um, was also from forever 21 and this bag is from H&M, my handy dandy assistant here has told me that. 
But um, yeah, guys, that's my outfit. What else am I wearing? Watch Michael Kors beret from a random place in the mall. Um, and I'm probably just gonna wear my ber my gray, not trench coat, but like nice coat to finish off the look. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let's get ready with me. Uh, it was really fun to record, and look forward to shooting more holiday videos for you guys. I feel so weird. Her recording me. Okay, bye guys.